work is creating emotions on canvas. This is what Abstract Expressionist is all about. I deal with colors that uh, uh, brings out a lot of warmth with the orange and the reds, and the blues will come out with, uh, uh, it could be sympathetic feelings as well. And so anything can happen. There is no boundaries in using my colors. And I also explore and uh, make different kind of colors by mixing them together. And I use all kinds of colors and movement, spatula, and of course the brush. The paintings are so important in their expression of space and, and movement and, and texture and sense of freedom that is there uh, because she works from a very intuitive part of her sensibilities and that comes out in her work. What really inspires me to do and to choose the color that I want is poetry and music. Music, music, always music, and it could be any kind of music. It could go from Vivaldi to Brahm to even rock and roll or jazz. I love jazz. That brings out a lot of energy in me. She obviously listens to, to music because that's there in, in her paintings. One can sense it almost when you look at the work. There's a lot of um, a uh, lot of movement that is, I think, in keeping with the very sheer sound of music in free form. Sunrise. It was a walk on the beach on Rickendine Island, and I was looking at the color of the sand and the, the waves coming in, and I was just imagining sunset on that beach. Crest of a wave. That was a journey when I went to the beach on the Jersey Shore with my granddaughters and my daughter. So we started jumping the waves and that got me so excited and I was jumping in it and the wave just wrapped me up and took me back and forth. And so therefore it was a beautiful sunny day, blue skies. Another painting would be walking in a wild field where you see a lot of ferns and wildflowers and uh, all the natural color from the earth, very earthy color with the sunshine. This just helped me to create more and more. We're happy to welcome her back to this exhibition. I hope that you will have the opportunity to come and see Nancy's work here at Agora Gallery.